Oh no! We have a sad dog. Even his ice cream truck wrecked. Whatever are we gonna do? Good thing we have this. What's up, guys, and welcome back to another episode of Super Cooper Sun. I think we woke him up from his nap. 97 ways to make a dog smile. Looks like we're already working. We're already doing something right. This book has been a favorite of ours for a long time. I think this is probably the fourth or fifth episode we've done. Yeah. I'm convinced we're going to make it all the way through. Let's do another five today. Does the first one have anything to do with oversized Halloween lamb chops? It has nothing to do with that. Okay. His seasons are way off. He needs way some off. help. Number two in the book, inner ear noogies. Put your hand in a noogie position and with the knuckle of your middle finger, rub the little piece of cartilage that juts out at the entrance of your dog's ear. The dog's head will probably tilt to one side with her eyes half closed. Look at this unsuspecting land seal and prime Nuggy position. Good boy. A little bit of a head tilt. Oh. I love it. <laughs> good boy. Those are some some big ears we've got going on here. Yeah. Good feels boy. Good. It feels good. Feels He's good. always so thankful. You're he always he good. gives a look. Oh, there's a smile. Good boy. All right, now stop. Okay, the thankfulness kind of He's asking for it's belly rubs. By the I, I think I think he liked it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's, good. that's a pretty good smile right there. Does that feel good? And stop. <laughs> okay. He's waiting for something else to happen. <laughs> I think you activated something. Turn something on, I don't know. I'm, I'm not sure what you activated, but you activated him. Number 66, the shell game. Now we have played a version of this. I think it was in like a brain game episode, but we're gonna try it today too. Play the classic sleight of hand game using a tree and plastic cups. Dogs have the slight advantage of being able to smell which of the rearranged cups is hiding the tree, but they're delighted to find it all the same. Come one, come all, welcome to Bella's shell game. <laughs> <laughs> she is 100% in. The game hasn't started, <laughs> and there's a there's a interference already, so we need to eliminate the interference, unless she's going to play. I guess Bella has made it clear that she's up wait, first, wait, so we're going to put some cat food. No <laughs> cheating, all right, Bella? We're going to put it under there. <laughs> You're going to blow her little mind. You got to get it. I don't have it. He, <laughs> he he's... Just <laughs> She's not really about these games. She she likes to be given the food and not work for it. I don't have it. We don't have it. It's it's under one of the cups. You see that? All right, it's in there. Now we're gonna mix them up. Coda might help you out. She's not very smart, is she? Thinking, thinking. I uh, you you saw it in the cup. All you right. Have to get it yourself. Here, just take it. You win. Wow. Really worked hard for that one. What sweatshirt is this? A wet dog one. Do you like it? Why? What's the wrong with the back? <laughs> There's a hole. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, it's thick enough that I didn't even feel that. Is disgusting. Bella, let them have a turn. It Here, that's a dog treat. You already got some, you'll get more later. He got it. Good boy. First try. That's what I'm talking about. Nice job, buddy. And it's big boy's turn. You ready, buddy? I love him so much. He he very clearly is trying to sniff each cup. We'll see if he gets it. That's your choice. To be honest, I wasn't paying attention. Was that right? No. Oh no, Coda, there's nothing in there. Try again. <laughs> He's gonna eat the cup. <laughs> Coda, you got like 50,000 cups a few weeks ago. I don't I don't think we need to worry about this one cup, Can you all right? Get the cookie. Get the cookie, get it. Sniffing. Good boy. 
Not gonna lie, Coda, I expect you to do better than Coop there. All right, buddy, not that it's a competition, but that last one was kind of slated for you. This one might be stacked against you, but we'll see. What's the next one? Number 90, everybody limbo. Be prepared for serious cheating. Dogs will go under the handle, stomach down, and when the going gets tough, they usually give up and leap over the handle. Phase one. Here we go. Oh, it's it's a little uneven. Can you go under it? Go, limbo. Good boy. Go. Come on, Coda. Go. Good boy. Nicely done. Next up, we'll remove the pillows. Come on, good boy. Come on, Coda. Come on, come on. Oh. <laughs> what are you doing? Get him. Come on, Carter. Good boy. Come on, good boy. Army crawl if you have to. <laughs> he's he's going to cheat any which way he can. <laughs> good boy. Come on, you got it. Good boy. Good, good boy. <laughs> he's enjoying it. He's just not, he's not quite getting it. Come on, Carter. Come on, good boy. <laughs> You know, and regulated limbo, I don't think that would count, but. I don't even think he knows I moved it for him. I think he thinks he did. We he count it here on Super Cooper Sunday. Good job, buddy. And round three, let's see if we can get it this time. Come on, Coda, good boy. Come here. Look at that enthusiasm. Now, Coop, don't disappoint us here, okay? You are a smaller dog, so there's no way you, you can't Coopy, not beat him, all right? Come here. Go underneath. Good boy, round one done. Round two is probably gonna be a little bit tougher. Let's see if we can get it. Go, good boy, come here. Good boy. He actually kind of like tried to get under it there, not just plow through it. All right, let's see what our plan is for the third one. Come on, Coop. Coopy, come here. <laughs> he stepped on the pillow. <laughs> I'm actually really curious. Coopy, come here, come down here, down here, down here, down here. Good boy, can you do it? You got it. Come here. He's not sure what we need. Good girl, come on. She's like, eh, if he really wants me, he'll move it. Bella, I know you can get under that easy. Bella, come here. Good girl, come on. The cat one is more about getting your cat to listen to you and less about the physical act of being able to do it. Hey, I think you might like this one. It's number 10, the white glove massage. For a simple variation on more standard massages. <laughs> Try your usual process with a pair of socks on your hands. The sensation is quite different for the dog because you're covering much more surface area with each stroke and because your hands look funny with socks on them. Okay, I She's giving you the business. I she was, walked away, flicked her tail, said, nah, I'm good. I was gonna give you a massage, but that's cool. She's like, this isn't the cat's book. This one isn't for me. We're gonna have to do that she one. She acts the same way when we do the cat's one. If I'm trying to do it. <laughs> You ready, Coop? Sock massage, here we go. Wow, would you look at those socks? How perfect. <laughs> oh, look at that, Coop. <laughs> Getting the hands. Oh, okay, okay. A little, no a little crazy. A little crazy. No nibbling the socks. You're nibbling the socks. I never would have thought to use socks, but I guess it does kind of make sense. Yeah, but guess what else it does? Hair. No. That's nasty. Who did that? No. <laughs> it is my hand. Oh, wow, Coda. He seems a little nervous. Huh. It's just a sock, buddy. Oh, he's got to sniff. Oh, oh, okay, that's good. Good no, I wasn't boy. This boy loves him some lovin's. Yeah. I don't think I've ever met another dog that like leans into every pet. Oh yeah, I'm holding him up. Watch this, ready? <laughs> he, just, he just lives for loving. 73, slow-mo. Dogs are fascinated by extremes. Try performing normal activities such as preparing a treat or a meal in slow motion. Tremors of anticipation can reach a 4.0 on the Richter scale. It's not. <laughs> Look at the concentration on Coda's face. I'll let you talk. Don't you talk to me. He's trying to watch to see which one's gonna hit the ground first. <laughs> Bella, you don't eat here. What are you doing? This is not your restaurant. My legs are gonna give out before you. <laughs> oh my god, Coda's mouth is like a faucet. <laughs> 
Good boys. I'm curious if Koopa's gonna go for no. it while it's in your hand. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> that was pretty good. Nice job. Be slow -mo too, but he wasn't that slick. I'll give Koda that one. At least Koda actually waited and had manners. Hello. Unlike Hi. someone here. Your food is upstairs in your dad's office. You have never eaten with the boys. You have full access to food at all times because you can handle it. These two can't. You come down here and you pressure them out of their food. That's unacceptable. So there you guys have it. Five more ways to make a dog smile. I would venture to say that anytime you give them food, that's a pretty easy bet that they're gonna be happy. Hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you guys so much for watching. I genuinely do wanna try to get through this whole book, so. Quite a few more episodes of this on the way in the future, but uh, we've got some exciting episodes coming up next. We've got a very exciting boat day plan and a brand new kind of like boat accessory that I think Coop's gonna absolutely love. The lake's starting to get warm. Of course, probably some swimming episodes and stuff. It's gonna be a great summer. We've got some fun ideas and we'll see you guys there. Peace out.